All right, so it's day 29, uh, War 3 said UK mod. Um, we've got it set to, uh, let me see here again. I can't remember. Oh yeah, I won't be able to find out. I think it's, I think it's, I think I misspoke. I think I set it to 32 zombies per night. It could be 64, I can't, oops, I can't remember. Um, but our game stage before the horde is 257, level 75. Um, it was an eight day pass this time before the horde arrived, so that's why it's day 29. Um, base is basically the same. The difference is I added plates, which I never actually upgraded these ones to steel, but uh, I should actually just go do that right now. I think I got time. Um, so the base is basically the same. Um, I didn't upgrade anything, like I said, other than putting like steel plates underneath here. Uh, just in case they do blow through these. There we go. Perfect. In case they blow through these blocks, at least these whole thing isn't gone. I had two more blade traps. We never got a chance to use them all last time. Or use any of them last time because they decided not to come up the ramp. So my thought was either one of two things. One, it was the barbed wire that for some reason was causing them not to path up the ramp. Or two, it was because... I added steel to the stairs for some reason and they figured that that wasn't a way to get to me. Um, so I took all that out. Let's get these on. Um, yeah, here we go. Now they're coming up this way. Perfect. I took that out because I found um, between between the uh, horde and now, the solo zombies were actually coming up this way. With the... With the um, with the barbed wire gone. So that's why I went this route this time. Now I made, as you can see in my tool belt, I made a ton of grenades. Um, and the gren I made that many grenades just in case for whatever reason they decided they weren't going to come up this way. This gun is supposed to have less recoil, but it's still got a ton of recoil. A few of you are blowing up. Yeah, forget it. We gotta go this route. So, yeah, I'm just gonna leave the barbed wire off from now on. And for me. Now it's gotta go. Well, I got a bunch of extra weapons on my tool belt just for times like this. When I, oh crap. Yeah well. I don't want the cops to blow up, right? So I was hoping to be able to uh, deal with them. And if I wasn't able to, then I could just switch up my weapon. Gotta keep these things loaded. This thing isn't bad, but it's, um, for some reason it just feels like it's got low power. Yeah, that H, that, yeah, the HK is, um, supposed to have less recoil, but this M60 has got less recoil than the HK. Dance for me. I got tons of ammo too, as you can see. I made more ammo. Whoop, see ya. I made more ammo this time than I had last time. We got plenty to make it through the horde night. I got a ton of shotgun ammo. I don't even expect the door is going to take very much damage tonight. But I didn't realize that I can actually reach the door when I'm standing beside the shotgun turret. So if I need to repair it, I can just do it while I'm standing there. Oops, time to repair. And I made lots of repair kits this time too, so I got eight for automatic weapons. As you can see, most of my weapons are level six. Um, and that's because I made them level six. 
the shotgun I found, the AK I found, but everything else I've made, with the exception of the M60, I actually found that. Well, I got it in one of those supply drops. Not like an airdrop, but um, you can find like uh, little flares that can give you supply drops. I found it in one of those. I actually got two of them in one. Both level five. What they should do is increase the um, durability on these weapons. And then, uh, wow, that guy was mad. And then when they break, they break for good. Just to make it even harder. Like you can't repair them. Especially these guys. Like hunting rifles, okay, sure, I can see you repairing it. Maybe a shotgun. But an M60, like where are you going to find the parts to repair an M60? Unless you have another one, right? Either that or make it make the repairs get um, weapon specific. I'm going to run out of ammo. So let's repair the let's get this guy going. I'm gonna bring down the uh, I got a sniper rifle here. And I gotta get some kills with this thing, so. Am I not loaded? I'm not loaded. Look at that guy. He's like, fuck this, I don't need to follow the rules. Where's my sound? Don't die. Or don't blow up on me. Yeah, I lost the sound of this thing. It's kind of annoying. Oh, screw off. I'm not really worried about the demo zombies. I'm more worried about the cops. It's because of the volume, I think, more than anything. You, it looks like he's puking bananas at me. Like, it looks like bunches of, like, bananas. Alright, I want to see how far... That goes... Oh, it hits them. And two cops are going to blow up. Or maybe not. Yeah, they are hitting down here. So half of them are... have decided that this is a... Vi well, maybe not. Some of them have decided that's a viable option. Radiated bikers have so many hit points. This rifle is devastating. Eight, nine, ten. Oop. Am I out? Oh, I don't have the clip extender, that's why. I would have got nine rounds. Oh, that makes sense. Hey! Get off of my shit. Look at this guy. Alright, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This rifle does so much damage. Five, six, 
seven, eight, nine. The damage on this thing is like ridiculous. I don't military zombies. I got my penetrator up a little higher too. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So the damage on this rifle is range damage 199. Now I don't I've only got one mod on it right now, which is the scope. I had it, I think it was around 230. I had a clip extender on it, the rad remover. Uh, and I think it was the bipod I had on it. Are they banging on that? I don't know. Transforming. Ooh, that took his head right off. Wow, my aiming is so bad. Is they banging on the door? I think so. Looks like my blade traps are slowly wearing down. Let's reload this. And repair. Yeah, they even, they're not even getting to the door, really. So it looks like the uh, those things are a bust now. All right, 14 more. Let's complete my quest. Hey, oh, I didn't reload. Right in the throat. I hear them bang, but I don't know. What door that's on? Probably check that. Hey, don't you bark at me. Dance for me. Get that loaded up. This shotgun too is throwing some real work over here. We're banging on something down here. Oh, hey guys. Give that, give those guys that. Yeah, not much. There's only two blade traps left. Should probably take the scope off this thing. Where am I at? 77? barfing at me. Nah, yeah, uh, they're not really doing anything down here. Yeah, it's a good thing they're not down here this time. I mean, there's a, they, they get angry when they fall off. Oh, I finished that quest. Beautiful. I don't have to use this rifle anymore. So, this weapon here, the HK. Oh, I picked up a silencer or something. I mean, 
not bad for recoil, I guess. High rate of fire, but the damage really isn't that great. I find the AK is better. Although the one thing about this thing is that it's got a really large um, clip with a, with a um, extended clip on it. It's got um, 72 rounds, which is pretty good. We're halfway through the night. All my traps are done. It's all going to come down to firepower now. Which I'm not really worried about. I mean, I got a crap ton of... Oh, we picked up some good stuff here. Dragon off silencer. Of course, I don't have a dragon off. Guess I got to make it. Yeah, so the cost to repair this base last time really wasn't that much. Any blocks that were internal, past the steel that got damaged. I just used rebar and then upgraded it to um, steel right afterwards. I thought about replacing this shotgun turret with an SMG turret. But I like the spread of the um, shotgun. Especially when there's so many of them on the walkway. The pellets that don't hit the guy you want it to hit will hit somebody else. So you get the most, I think, the most bang for your buck out of the shotgun turret. Especially at this close range. I could be wrong, I could be convinced otherwise, but I'm planning on making one of the um, the HD I'm planning on making one of the HD um, 9 mil um, jump turrets but the thing is, is I wouldn't take it with me when I go out because these weapons do so, many, so much damage that it's not really even worth spending the time putting it down buddy. Like for instance, I've got the, uh, the, the Desert Eagle here. Pistol. And shooting most zombies in the head with this is a kill shot. See what I mean? I'm talking about average zombies too. Like the, the radiator is obviously going to take a little bit more, right? This gun is 45 ACP. They've got it listed as 45 millimeter, but I don't think it's 45 millimeter because it's not really like that's like less than half a centimeter, which is tiny, right? I think what they mean is 0.45 inch. Still going. Don't you blow up down there, you it's gonna cost me repairs.
Yeah, so this was going going so much easier than last time. They're not even touching the base. So it's weird that for some reason they the last time they just saw that barbed wire as, as being not passable or something. I don't know. Because I had it there the first time I ran the horde. Which I didn't record. Is I out of ammo? I'm out of ammo for this thing. Beautiful. Finally. Oh, I guess I picked up a dragon off when I completed that quest. Yeah, the horde is like baby horde now. I think a lot of the problem is that they're uh, they're radiated uh, and they're um, barrels who move a lot slower. They do a lot more damage if they hit you, but they're so slow that it takes forever to get up the ramp. Yeah, he's still going. Those bikers take a lot. I think I probably do more damage to my base than these guys do. But I've got my other side pretty much set up now. I'll show you that when the video is over, or when the board's over. Once again, I'm a big fan of the solid concrete um, sort of base plates on a base. So it's the new, uh, my new side is like fully uh, solid concrete. Now it's not meant to take on a horde, obviously. The freaking shotgun turret's handling most shit over here. Like, look at. Gotta make sure they're dead. Not sure if you guys can hear my AC going in the background, my air conditioner, but I had to have it on for this. It's just too hot to record with it off. Summer's almost over though, so that's a good thing. Can get back to recording, not having to worry about AC. Uh, let's repair this. Back to this for a bit. See what I mean though? This thing is devastating. If you can get headshots. Oh, there's the first demo of the night. No, you... Damn it. They must have nerfed the demos. They, they ought to have to have... Well, the door is down to half. I mean... This is the gun I've been using to clear uh, POIs with. Now oh, you take care of him. I got these guys. You know what I should do? Just thinking, I should put a second, um, I should extend those, those blocks out here, out one more, and put a second, um, wire in, and then have it on a separate switch, so that I can just turn it on halfway through the horde. These guys sure take a lot of hits. But 
especially these guys. Ah, at least we, at least we're running out of cops. Or just slowing down. It is really slow right now. Which has got. I, it's got to be because these guys are moving so slow that when it spawns new ones in, it takes forever to get here. Kind of hear a few of them banging, but did we outlast the horde? No, they're still they're still coming. That guy evaporated. Kind of glad I didn't need my, uh... Well, I took care of both of those guys? Kind of glad I didn't need my grenades tonight. Although that demo zombie must have... I must have taken damage from that. I didn't really look at my health bar. But I think that's the reason why I took so much damage. There's the morning. Ah, I just hit my own thing there. Reloaded. Yep. Yep. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? First zombie that got in my base is because I let him in. Well, let's uh, not take any chances with the radiated. Alright, now I can go jump down. Come on guys, I'm over here. Yeah, not much left. They didn't do anywhere near as much damage as before. Yeah, see how slow they are? If I could make any suggestion, it would to uh, be to speed up the ferals. They are on jog during the day, so they're pretty darn slow. I saw you. I've got like no bags tonight too. See what I mean about these guys taking a lot of hits. Well, three contact grenades. So I'm thinking about the next series that I do. I don't know which, whether it's going to be Alpha 19 or what it's going to be, but when I do my next series, um, thinking about trying one where it's. Um, I can't actually make anything important, like anything that's like high technical stuff. So vehicles or any of that kind of stuff. I gotta buy all the components from the uh, trader. See how far that gets me. Because most of the stuff that I have up here, like these electrical fence traps here, the blade traps I picked up from the trader. Oh, this one's gone. I think the shotgun destroyed that one. Um, but like all the components that are in the switches I got from the trader, the first doors that I added here, the steel doors, um, 
I bought the steel from the traders. I didn't have a crucible. Shotgun turret is bought from the traders. Now there's a bunch of stuff you have to make because you it's really like you can't really get it like the uh, advanced cement mixer and all these tool benches the HD forge all that stuff you can't um, get from the trader um, but everything else I'm thinking about just buying it but that's my this is my uh, secondary base that's where I'm gonna move all of my gear to because I don't know how crazy the hordes are gonna get like it's only day 30 uh, we only got one demo that night this night but if I thought I had it at 64 zombies but I think it was set to 32 so I'm gonna have to crank it make sure it's at 64 for the next one but uh, that's the next base and if I have to get over there um, from this painted block right here this dividing line all the way down so that's the floor of this second level all the way down is all reinforced concrete so if they decide to try and smash in there it's all concrete the whole like it's all reinforced concrete blocks so good luck with that now, if I had to get over there for whatever reason during the horde night, I could just kind of go down here. And then I built a little tunnel. Well, it's a little bigger. It's a bit bigger tunnel, I guess. And then it comes up here. So I haven't finished it in here yet. It's just kind of partially painted gonna move the stuff in here and then this is gonna be a shaft so hoping to I think I may have to knock these walls out because I think the elevator the truck elevator um, the HD truck ele elevator the 5x5 five five, I don't think will fit in here so I think I want I want to make this an elevator so I may have to knock these walls out and put an elevator that goes up to the second floor um, but we'll see how it goes I don't know that's the goal anyway I've got a partial wall all the way around the traders right now I got some room for for gates that I'm going to put in but I'm going to make it look like it's like a, a defended war zone um, I've got it kind of set so that the zombies can kind of get to my base no problem so this whole open area here is all clear uh, they were walking along that fence line I saw while we were fighting so um, they didn't really um, pay too much mind to that uh, like fence being there um, and they they have the ability to jump over it now. Probably just put like some barbed wire on it. So, yeah, no knocked out blocks this time. As long as you're focused on above and not hitting down here, like even last time they knocked out two of these blocks, so they could have taken this whole pillar out, and I think it would have been fine. But like I said, it's all reinforced now. There's extra plates on the bottom, right? It's all protected. So anyway, I'm gonna end this here. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, the next time I record will be, of course, whatever the next Horde Night is. Last one was day 29, so it could be anywhere between, yeah, day 29. So it could be anywhere between 35 and, and 37 day, whatever it is. And I'm uh, hoping that by that time my uh, game stage will be up close to 300. Probably not, but it might be. It didn't go up that much tonight. But we'll see how it goes. Alright, see you later.